Web Performance Optimization, OWPO, or Front End Performance, is an area of web development concerned with making websites faster. Not only through the initial load into the browser, but for any user interaction or additional loading thereafter. Broadly, it involves measuring performance and recording metrics relating to how fast website loads. This should be continuous and supported with processes such as performance budgeting. After all, it's important to make sure that as the website grows and develops, loading performance doesn't regress and only gets better. Once we've recorded load time metrics, the next step is to improve them. This is largely done by performance optimizations which reduce HTTP response latency. The time it takes to get a website's assets from the server to the browser. This allows the browser to render the website sooner. Web performance is also heavily influenced by psychology and the user's own perception of loading. Regardless of how slow a website objectively loads, if the user feels the website loads fast, then for all intents and purposes, the website loads fast. Therefore, an important part of web performance optimization includes improving perceived performance. This is all about creating a perception that the website is loading faster than it actually is, and where that's not possible, helping the user deal better with the wait. Overall, web performance shouldn't be a box ticking exercise, a technical concern which developers get around to at the tail end of a project, or sometimes not at all. Web performance is bigger than that. It's about making the website accessible to the widest possible audience. It should be a concern of everyone in the business who is invested in the success of the website, not just developers. Good performance can be an asset to a business, whilst bad performance can be a disadvantage or worse, a liability leading to lost revenue. Being a little more specific, web performance is about accommodating users, looking after users, improving conversions, search engine optimization, and perceived performance. In the next few videos, we'll explore each of these points in more detail.